Welcome to my tutorial on how to upload an audio story to LushStories.com To start we're going to go to the Submit Story page. You can find the link for this on the home page at the top of the sidebar menu in black. If you've ever submitted a written story to Lush before you should be familiar with this page but for those of you who haven't I'll give you a quick run through. It's always important to read the notes at the top of the page just to make sure that your story fits within the rules of the site. First of all it's going to ask you for category. The category for my story is flash erotica so I'm going to select that. If you're ever unsure about which category to select for your story, it can be a good idea to go and read the descriptions at the top of the categories. Next we're going to add the title, for mine is Letting Go. And then it's going to ask us for tags. Tags are important for allowing the reader to search for the sort of content that they're going to enjoy. So I'm just going to add a couple into mine. A handy little tip for if you're struggling to think up tags, um, you can go to the home page and there's some great links on that page called popular tags and popular searches. The next box is an optional box and it gives us the opportunity to write a quick one-liner for our story. I'm not going to use one for this particular story but they can be a great way to hook the reader into yours. So far you've done everything that you would when submitting a standard story to Lush. This next part is important for audio stories. You need to select this box. Now the wording next to it can be a little confusing as it states this story is audio only, there is no written version. However, if you do want to have a written version for your audio story, you still need to select this box. Next, the site gives us the option to add a cover image for our story. You can select from any of the images that you have in your gallery on your profile page. As with avatars, cover pictures that depict explicit genital photos and hardcore images are not allowed. So next, depending on if your story is audio only or if you have a written version, uh, it will differ slightly. If your story is audio only, you just need to write a short little description of your audio in this box here. Personally, I prefer to have a full written version of my story, so I'm going to show you how to do that now. What I'm going to do is go to my saved Word document I've made sure that I've uh, carefully proofread and edited this story. Um, it can be a handy idea to get a friend to read through it or um, you can always submit your story for verification as a written form before you record the audio. That way if it gets returned to you for any reason you won't have wasted any time. All you have to do is write a short little note to the moderator just asking that they return your story so you can record a audio for it. I'll show you where to do the note for moderators shortly. First of all I'm just going to copy and paste my story and I'm going to paste it here into the box. What it's going to do is going to flag up a question asking would you like to clean word format? I always select OK with that. So then now it's transferred your story across, it's important to give it a good read through. Um, sometimes the system can remove spacing so it will lump a couple of words together. So it's important just to read through and um, check the spacing on your story is all correct. At the top here um, there is no need to have a title in this box so I'm just going to remove that. With a flash erotic story there is a word limit of 100 to 1000 words so what I'm going to do I'm just going to go down to the bottom here and check my word count to make sure that I'm within the limit. 
once you're happy with everything in that box you can scroll down slightly and what it's going to do here is give you the option if your story is part of a series and you want to put a link to the other parts then you can select from that part there and it also gives you the option to add a copyright information if your story is a collaboration with another author and you wish for their names to appear on the story you can type their names in here so earlier I mentioned about leaving a note for the moderator so this is the box that allows you to do that I'm just going to add a little note here that says um, this oops this is an audio story please wait for the audio to be uploaded before you verify thank you so once you're happy with that what we can then do is go to the bottom here and click continue what that's going to do is take you to the preview page which basically shows you what your story is going to look like when it goes online. It's important just to check through and make sure you're happy with everything. If you need to go back and change something, you can go to edit story and it will take you back to the previous page. If you are happy with everything though, uh, reading at the bottom here, it gives you a little prompt to send your audio MP3 file to an email address. So what I'm going to do is copy and paste that email address into an email. And I'm just going to write another little note that says, this is the audio file for my story, letting go by audio stories one. That way it's just going to help them know which story to attach to and speed up the process. And then another little thank you. All I need to do then is insert the audio file that I've got saved in MP3 format. You're just going to have to give it a little while just to uh, load up there. But once it's all loaded you can hit send. Then we're going to go back to the Lush profile um, sorry the lush preview page what you can then do is hit publish story what that's going to do is send your story to the queue for verification if you aren't quite ready for your story um, to go online then you can always hit save draft so that concludes my tutorial on how to upload an audio story to lush.com I hope you found it helpful, but if you have any questions, please feel free to message me at audiostories1.